Hello, Viri here. Today, I received a message from dear Roxana regarding making a video on text yourself in the end of this science coursework, class 3. So let's start. Test yourself. Chapters 1 to 7. A. Tick the correct answer. 1. Which of the following is not an underground stem? Carrot. 2. The leaves of the touch-me-not plant close when touched. 3. Which of the following is a perching bird? Both B and C. 4. The skeleton protects soft organs such as the all of these. 5. At school, always keep to the left while walking in the corridor. B. Fill in the blanks using the words given in the box. Non-living, kite, banyan, food chain, tap and trunk. 1. A food chain shows how living things depend on each other for food. 2. A banyan tree has a hard and thick stem called the trunk. 3. The moon is a non-living thing. 4. A kite is a bird of prey. 5. A tap root has one main root. C. State true or false. 1. There are about 650 muscles in the human body. True. 2. We can throw garbage anywhere in the school false 3 west bengal is the largest producer of jute in india true 4 the air that we breathe in is rich in carbon dioxide false 5 nylon is a man made fiber true match the following sharp pointed teeth belongs to tiger Long sticky tongues belongs to frog. Sharp front teeth belongs to rabbit. Flat back teeth is for sheep. And long pointed tube is for the butterfly. Circle the odd one out. Number one, heart, brain, blood vessels and blood. Brain is the odd one. Footpath, traffic lights, zebra crossing and subway, traffic lights. Cotton, thermometer, bandage, fruit juice, fruit juice. 4. Food pipe, large intestine, stomach, and ureter, ureter. 5. Polyester, cotton, silk, and wool, polyester. Answer the following questions. We will refer to these questions in the notebook. Question number 1. Write any four features of living things. The four features are 1. Living things move. 2. Living things grow. 3. Living things breathe. and 4. Living things feel. Number 2. Write the differences between body, down and flight feathers. Body feathers. They cover the steam-lined body of the bird and also give shape to their body. Down feathers. They grow close to the skin and keep the body warm. They are short, soft and fluffy. Flight feathers. They are large in size and these are found in the tail and wings. They help birds to lift themselves and provide balance for flight. Question number 3. Explain any three ways in which domestic animals are useful to us. 1. A hen gives us eggs and meat. 2. A sheep gives us wool. And 3. Dogs guard our homes. Question number 4. Draw and label the parts of a leaf. For the answer, you can refer to page number 16 in your course book. Question number 5. Name A a climber and be a vegetable whose leaves store food. 
A is money plant and B can be coriander. Number six, write any two safety rules that you should follow while playing in the playground. One, do not throw stones at each other or at stray animals while playing. And number two, do not play in wet fields. You may fall down and injure yourself. Number seven, draw a well-labeled diagram of the digestive system. For this drawing, you can refer to page number 46 from the course book. Question number eight, what are natural fibers? Give two examples. Fibers that come from either plants or animals are called natural fibers. Examples can be cotton and silk. Question number nine. List any three tips that should be kept in mind while cleaning the house. Number one. All things in the house must be dusted regularly. Number two. Air fresheners can be used to keep the air clean and fresh. And number three. Bed sheets and curtains must be washed regularly. And the last question is, discuss how the excretory system helps in removing waste material from our body. Kidneys remove waste in the form of urine. Carbon dioxide is removed from the lungs. And excess water and salt are removed by the skin in the form of sweat. Now, let's move on to test yourself, assessment 2, chapters 8 to 14. A. Tick the correct answer. 1. In how many forms does water exist? 3 forms. 2. Which of the following rocks is the Taj Mahal made of? Marble. 3. The bottom portion of the ship disappears first if you see the ship sailing away from the horizon. 4. Weather changes every few days. And 5. Which of the following is a non-standard unit of measurement? Handspan. B. Fill in the missing words. Summer, mango, winter, carrot. 2. Rotation, axis, revolution, orbit. 3. One day, 24 hours, and one year, 365 days. Breeze is gentle, but storm is strong. And five, Saturn is sixth, and Mars is fourth. C, fill in the blanks using the words given in the box. Unpleasant, sand, animal dung, chair, and milliliter. 1. A chair is an example of a non-luminous object. 2. Milliliter is the smaller unit of measuring capacity. Sand particles have lots of air between them. 4. The sound from the horn of a car is unpleasant. And 5. Manure is a mixture of animal dung and decaying leaves of plants and trees. D. State true or false. 1. Air can be seen as well as felt. False. 2. Water is also found deep under the ground. True. 3. The moon does not rotate on its own axis. False. 4. Light travels in a straight line. True. And 5. The bottom layer of soil is made up of gravel. True. And answer the question and answers. We will refer to the notebook. Question number one. What is condensation? The process by which water vapor changes into water is called condensation. Two. What does the solar system consist of? Name the eight planets of the solar system. The sun and the eight planets that move around it in their fixed orbits is called solar system. And the eight planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Question number three. How was the Earth formed? 
The Earth was formed about four billion years ago from clouds of glasses, gases, and dust. In the beginning, it was very hot and surrounded by many hot gases. After years, it cooled down and the hot gases turned into clouds. The clouds caused rain. The rainwater collected on the ground and formed oceans. The temperature of the earth became stable and due to these conditions, life began on earth. Question number four. Explain any three ways in which weather affects our lives. One, flood and drought are weather effects we get from rain. Two, clouds do not let the heat of the earth escape into the atmosphere, so cloudy nights are warmer. And the third one, winds cause breeze and storms. Five, explain the water cycle with the help of a well-labeled diagram. For this, you can just refer to the page number 76. Question number six. Differentiate between sandy soil and clay soil. For clay soil, you can have clay particles are very small, clay particles are very smooth, Clay particles have no space for air between them and clay particles can hold a lot of water. And for sandy soil we have sand particles are large in size, sand particles are rough to touch, sand particles have a lot of space between them and sandy soil cannot hold water. Question number seven. How can you show that soil contains air. For answering this question, please refer to page number 110, activity 3. Number 8. Name the non-standard units of measurement that were used by people in earlier times. And why do you think these units are not used these days? Hand span, foot span, cubit, were some of the parameters used in earlier times. They are not used these days because the size of the non-standard units are different in each person and they give us inappropriate measures. Question number nine. How can you show that light travels in a straight line? For answering this question, please refer to page number 110. 18. Activity 1. And the last question is, draw a well-labeled diagram of the different layers of soil. And for this answer also, you can refer to page number 109. So if you enjoyed my video, please do like, share, subscribe and thank you so much for watching.